10 tricks retailers use in stores and online to make you overspend Over the years, retailers have perfected on their skills to fleece customers on their hard-earned money in a sweet manner. This they do to get people to purchase more goods than they plan to buy. Thankfully, a good portion of those strategies they put in place to make you overspend is about to be exposed for you to be very careful of them. Thankfully, a good portion of those strategies they put in place to make you overspend is about to be exposed for you to be very careful of them. In this video, we'll be sharing with you 10 tricks retailers use in stores and online to make you overspend. If you are new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. 1. Conning Sales Attendants Ever wonder why stores have attendants that are extreme in their attitudes? They could either be too warm and patient or too harsh and snobby. It is a trick to get you to overspend after having an encounter with them. The average store will have pleasant attendants whose cheerfulness, attention and willingness to help you make choices will drive your soft heart into shelling out just a little more money so as not to hurt their dear souls. On the other hand, luxury stores have trained one of the meanest attendants you will ever meet. Unless you are a regular customer, chances are you could be treated harshly and in a way that suggests that the items you admired are beyond your reach. To prove them wrong, you will be forced to dig into your pocket or account to buy what you never budgeted for. Talk about protection of one's ego from unnecessary bruises. 2. Deceptive Pricing System Many retail stores choose to set the prices of items they sell in a decimal form. This purposeful tactic could get you to spend more while they lose nothing. By tagging an item at $1.99 instead of $2, your mind will register that it is a more affordable deal than if it was $2. In another form, you are made to have an impression that you are buying an expensive article when it ends with .00, like $40 and others. The most popular pricing trick is that of buying in bulk for less. For example, a necktie could sell for $2. To get you to buy more as a good deal, they could tag 5 of the neckties for $6. 3. The Free Shipping Trick This trends online. Retailers are smart to the point of wanting to make your home a warehouse of goods. This they do by cajoling you to buy more items to get free shipping. On a visit to a store's website, you could see flashing before you, for example, free shipping for goods over $35. You may not have planned buying anything above $20, but since it looks fair to buy some more items to avoid paying for shipping, you would have to bow to their order. 4. Regular Updates in Your Mailbox Retailers care a lot about their customer satisfaction and deem it right to give you regular updates on new arrivals goods on discount prices and goods on popular demand. They do so by sending you mails once you subscribe with your email address. By checking and clicking on the miniature pictures of the items, you could be lured into building your online shopping cart with goods that ordinarily you wouldn't have purchased. 5. Using good music to slow you down The power of music in a retail store should never be underestimated. It is not for want of entertainment that they serenade the environment with good music. They are after your money. By having you shop while soothing music plays softly in the store, you are relaxed to take shopping slowly and easy. Your eyes sweetly dance off to admire and feel items that you may end up buying, which were not in your shopping list. By the time you step out from the store, you would have realized that you have been played. It's too late. Sorry. 6. The Appeal to Your Sense of Sight Red is bold and gives an impression that the item needs to be owned by you or no one else. Pink is sexy and tugs at your romantic heart. 
Black is masculine, rich and powerful. Yellow shows freshness, while green and purple brings calmness and relaxation. The role blue plays is to get you to trust the brand. The color choices retailers use in advertising goods or in decorating their stores go a long way to grabbing your overspending attention. 7. They arrange goods in a way that will make you see them easily. While placing their pricier items, retailers keep them at an average eye level for customers to notice them easily. Because they are easy to spot, you could be tempted to lift any one of them up to check out. Since it has been established over time that people tend to purchase more of what they feel with their hands, you could buy that expensive item you laid your hand upon. Also, stores keep the everyday goods like milk, yogurt and chocolates at the back. On your way to get them, your eyes could dart to and fro to notice items that are not in your budget. At the payment counter are arranged chewing gums, magazines, can openers, shoe polishes and other cheap items which you could grab on impulse while waiting for your turn to pay. 8. The use of free samples to catch you Many classic stores have corners where they offer free samples of products or food to taste. By going over to see or taste, you could be lured into buying on the spot to make the attendant happy or to further satisfy your already aroused cravings. 9. They keep shopping carts and baskets at the entrance Many have fallen for this trick time and again. Once you're comfortable with a load carrier, you're unconsciously in the mood to throw in as many things as possible into it. Retailers know that and so welcome you with the carriers in the form of baskets and shopping carts. Worse still, when they are shopping with your child in the cart or hand in hand with your lover pushing the cart, you're bound to spend more than you ever imagined before stepping into the store. 10. They use personalized adverts It is creepy the moment you notice of recent that ads that pop up on your screen as you browse show sandals and coats you had once looked through on a store's website. Fear no more, that online store tracked your cookie as you checked those items and decided to terrorize you with the same or similar items so that you will succumb and buy them someday. In conclusion, your life will be better if you understand that retailers are after your money. Be watchful and resist the temptation to overspend, especially on things you don't really need. Thank you for watching our videos. We'd like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we unpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.